Hello again everyone. In this video tutorial I am going to show you an easy alternative method to find the determinant of any 3x3 three three matrix. So let's go ahead and get started with this example right up here. So the very first step I want you to do is just go ahead and put down these red and blue columns to the right right up here. 3 negative 1 and 6 and put down the blue column as well just next to it. So negative 2, 0 and negative 4. So what I did is simply I just put down these two columns. I just copy and paste it over here. So the next thing is what I want you to do is let's go ahead and uh, make some groups diagonally. So let's go ahead and group these three numbers diagonally. Let's go ahead and group these three numbers diagonally and finally these three numbers diagonally. So the next step is I want you to go ahead and multiply all these three numbers in that group. 3 times 0 times 0 is going to be what? zero obviously. This negative 2 times 8 times 6 is going to be what? Negative 96 and negative 5 times negative 1 times negative 4 is going to be what? Negative 20. I want you to add these three numbers, whatever these three numbers, right up here and put the answer right here which turns out to be negative 116. Now we're going to be repeating the same process the other way around. Let's look at it over here. So I'm going to do the grouping once again, diagonally the other way around. That's your one group. This is going to be your another group. And finally, this is going to be our last group. So let's go ahead and multiply these numbers exactly the same way we did before. 0 times negative 1 times negative 2 would obviously be a 0. Negative 4 times 8 times 3 is going to be what? Negative 96. And finally, 6 times 0 times negative 5 is going to be 0 again. Now I want you to add these numbers up. That's going to give you what? Negative 96. So the final step is going to be this one. I want you to just whatever value you got right up here and this one, you have to put a minus sign in between. So that's what I'm going to do right now. I want you to put down negative 116 and then I want you to put down minus sign and then put down this 90, negative 96 right up here. Let's go ahead and simplify negative and negative become positive. So this is simply is going to become what negative 116 and this become positive 96. When you simplify these are unlike signs, so we're going to subtract and keep the sign of the larger number, which turns out to be negative 20, and that is our answer to this 3 by 3 determinant. Thanks for watching.